Goodness gracious, Eric. Goodness gracious. Don't we, get this guy on your carpet. Don't let the game. Don't get on the carpet. What is up, you guys? Welcome back to another video. So today we are uh, trying to build. Uh, I, I don't. I mean, we kind of put it in the title and thumbnail, but let's just go downstairs and uh, see what we're working with, what we're working on. Basically, the idea is to build a snow machine. Okay, so basically we have a bunch of pieces. Yeah, a bunch of pieces. Yeah. <laughs> I mean. Hook it up to the water hose, hook it up to the air compressor, and we're gonna atomize the water and uh, put it all on top of a ladder and hope that it works out. Yeah, so, so in English, we have a snow. bunch of pipes. We're gonna connect them, make it so that it's like misting water when it's cold outside which hopefully will make snow by the time it hits the ground. Which is not gonna be today, it's like 44 degrees outside. Yeah, but, but we can make the whole contraption and see if it actually works. Um, but we're gonna do um, prime every single fitting first. You gotta put the purple goo on and then the clear goo. And then stick them together and then it makes it so that it... Melts together and bonds. Yeah. Glues it. Goodness! Eric, goodness gracious. Don't we, get this guy on your carpet. Don't let the game. Don't get on the carpet. Don't get on the carpet. It's a like freaking purple dye. I told, that just ruined my table. I told it not to get on the carpet. I don't know how well I did at telling it not to get on the carpet. But, oh, now it's on my lap. Well, that did not go as this planned. Is a fail. <laughs> Kids, don't mess with purple dye. Oh, my mouse pad's in the trash. Why? It smells so delicious. Looks like a robbed bank or something. Just kind of like purple dye. <laughs> Where's my eye? Never know. Hey, on the bright side, though, you had the purple goo, but you didn't have the clear goo. Okay, back to square one. Get your purple goo. <laughs> I already did that part. Yeah. <laughs> Your purple goo. Okay, now we're acting like it never happened. You just cut to a difficult, to a technical difficulty screen or something. Yeah. That's all you gotta do. This is kind of boring. I'm gonna cut to when we have a little bit more pieces together so it looks a little bit more promising. But I might still record because Eric's a little clumsy and we might spill some more stuff. After putting all this together and everything, it makes me want to make a potato cannon. Ah, oh, those are dangerous. Exactly. And then one of us stands in front of it. You. And see if we can take a potato to the stomach. You. I'm down. Are you going to shoot it? Uh, I don't, <laughs> as long as it's on film, then I am not liable for any of the injuries that come from that. Where <laughs> he just cuts this entire clip off of the video. <laughs> Next clip's Eric shooting me with a potato gun and I die. I'm <laughs> <laughs> suing. Final couple pieces. Last two pieces. Well, technically last piece now. The two ends. We got one end for the air compressor and one end for the hose. If this works and like is just like killer, we should sell these online. Nah, I'd have to build a higher pressurized one with galvanized steel. Do that. Don't know what that means, but we could sell a low end one. No, too much risk. These can explode with the amount of pressure. Well, will we just make the purchaser. PVC is not designed for pressure. Do not do anything that I'm showing you guys. The, we just tell people yeah. that they have to sign a waiver to buy our products. Yeah, that never works out. There you go. The snow machine. Water hose, air hose. Tiny little nozzle. I might have to make a little bit more holes on that, but I'd rather start with a smaller one first than make it bigger before we know for sure. Yeah, because we know holes that are this big and still going all, all over. <laughs> Looks like I robbed a bank or something. It was covered in purple. It really bag. does. <laughs> okay, so we uh, made our snow machine. We're not going to be able to use it today. So we're deciding to go to Meyer and pick up a watermelon because we want to do the same stream that we did a while ago where we put rubber bands around a watermelon and see how long it takes to explode. Also, Eric's never done uh, Coke and Mentos, so we have some Mentos at the house, and we're gonna grab some uh, some Coke and see 
what happens with Coke and Mentos. Diet Coke, so it's not sticky. The drink? No, Coke, like the powder. They don't have a watermelon, we could do it with a, a grape. Oh, watermelon. oh mini watermelons. Personal, personal seedless watermelon. Oh, we could each do one. Have three watermelons. Yeah. Okay, pick watermelon. your watermelon. Pick, you should we do a honeydew, a watermelon, and a cantaloupe? I'm getting, no, no, get, get two watermelons. We'll freeze one and we'll do one normal. Okay. Mini barcode. Dos. Go right no. sandy. It'd be so easy. Come on, go, Let's go, go right sandy. Okay. <laughs> oh, there's so many pennies on there. <laughs> See ya. No, you have to stay on for the whole ride. <laughs> okay, what's your idea? We're freezing this one for tomorrow. Okay. Why? Why are we freezing it? Because he wants to stand on the ground out there and then I chuck it off the roof at him. You ready to do Coke and Mentos? Now we're gonna do a prank one first. What's oh, a prank yeah, one? We're not gonna, we're not gonna, I'm just gonna show you how to make a prank one. Get a dental floss. 40 cents. $3.40. I will bet you $100 it doesn't explode. Because I've tried so many times. You have to throw it at the ground to have it explode. Throw some dry ice in there. Yeah, we'll have an explosion. Put in Mentos. Mentos, they won't. Um, I'll put $3.40 on the line. <laughs> Should we just do it inside? No, 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 no. I'm not, I'm getting that. <laughs> you have to have something like hold it. I got two. Okay, ready? Three, two, one. Damn it. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> it's so hard to get it on fast enough. It caught on my plane. Dang it! Uh -huh. You want some Diet Coke? Sure. <laughs> That's so foamy. <laughs> I shook on the mento. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot it was in there. Are these holes gonna be big enough? We'll make it work. Dangle that over the edge. How bad would that be if the rubber band broke? It might. We should probably do this outside. Yeah, let's go tighten the rest of it down. Outside. Oh, turn it upside down, hold it in your hand. No, I don't want it to explode. <laughs> oh, wait, you think it's gonna explode? I don't think it will, but it might. <laughs> I'm not about to. Oh, uh, roll it, like, roll it down the steps. Just no, turn it upside down air. and throw it. Let's go on the well, then it's gonna explode. Okay, now throw it up there. It will explode if I do that. Well, down here, just make that. Get it? Oh. That was way better than all the other ones that we did that <laughs> Yeah, time. I know. In the process of doing uh, the stream with the watermelon, but we've been going for like a good hour and the watermelon hasn't budged at all. And, uh, I'm on a mission. Yeah, Monty's, Monty's going strong. But after we finish this stream, we're gonna go and test out the uh, snowmaker to see yes, if it works. I, 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 <laughs> I think it exploded. That's great! <laughs> I think it kind of made a mess too. I was reading, I was reading chat. You get closer to the, that little camera and do that. And it, there's juices all over the place from that watermelon. No way. And it's all over you guys. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna go test the uh, the pressure of the snow machine. See if this works. Fingers crossed that everything goes as planned and it doesn't explode in our face like the watermelon just did. Okay, air compressor. Moment of truth. Oh yeah, we gotta get the air compressor out of the garage. So basically what we're doing is we're feeding water in this pipe, air in this pipe, and so the more air we add, the more mystified it is, and uh, to the point that there's no water coming out because the air is just shooting out so fast. Well, I guess there is still water coming out, yeah. but anyways. You gotta, you gotta get it just right. If we get it just right and then we let it sit for long enough, it should build a uh, pile of snow. We got it down 
Now we just need to wait for the weather to uh, be colder so then uh, it will freeze. You guys, uh, I think it's gonna work. I think the snow machine is gonna work now. We just need to wait till it's uh, below 32 degrees and uh, once we get it to that point, then we are gonna actually put it outside for like, I don't know, overnight for a couple hours, 12 hours, and uh, see if we can build a pile of snow. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like, subscribe, and uh, remember my camera's always blurry. Remember, do what you love, never give up. I'll see you tomorrow, bye.